Welcome to the Tradex Foods 3-Minute Market Insight. This is Kyla Ganton and here is the seafood news for Monday, January 11, 2016. As the world crawls out from their holiday turkey comas and realize that Lent is fast approaching, buyers are beginning a last-minute scramble. The market is still hot on Pacific Cod, but locating product can be challenging. Welcome news arrived last week after the first landings of ACs in Pacific Cod produced larger sized fish than anticipated. One plant stated earlier this month that if the fish generated anything under an 8 ounce fillet, their plan would be to sell the fish headed and gutted instead. Fortunately for the short market, last week's average was around 4.7 pounds in the round. Fish this size has a 41% recovery, producing 30.8 ounce skinless boneless fillets which when divided into two fillets will fit into the 8 16 ounce fillet size. Prices are not yet determined, but, buy, but our advice to buyers would be to jump on any offers you receive as back orders from a several month dry spell have accumulated. Our Tradex Live offer of the week is for 4 to 8 ounce single frozen Pacific Cod fillets. These are boneless, skinless, shatter packed, trawl caught in Alaska, and available for $2.95 per pound, FOB Seattle. Click or tap the icon above to view this offer. The price gap between Atlantic Cod and Haddock has possibly reached its peak, but is it enough to bring old Haddock customers back? Surprisingly, even the current price floor on Haddock hasn't stimulated demand. Mid-season, the Haddock quota in the Atlantic increased by 25%, but fishing was still poor. The main season will start in March, at which point the boats will know if they can catch enough fish to decide where pricing will go. Current pricing in Boston on haddock loins is $2.78 per pound and skinless fillets are around the $2.73 mark. To contrast, Atlantic cod has crept up to between $3.50 per pound and $3.65 per pound in Boston. Atlantic cod harvests are projected to remain stable year to year at 1.29 million metric tons. Both whitefish species react the same way when cooking and are easy substitutes. So at a 25% price difference, why isn't this product moving? When haddock hit a price ceiling, customers switch back to cod again. Market adaptability is difficult once customers have developed product loyalty or familiarity. Chinese plants have predicted a 25% drop in Atlantic cod raw materials after Chinese New Year, at which point Lent will have thinned inventory levels and the market will be ready to start fresh. Thank you for joining me for the Tradex Foods 3-Minute Market Insight. This is Kyla Ganton. Buy smart and eat more seafood.